Hello YouTube, welcome to my channel, or welcome back if you've been here before. Thank you so much for joining me. My name is Michelle, and this is My Mini Ramblings, and today I'm going to be sharing with you some summer products from my best friend's store, Naturally Inspired. Now, these were out, I believe the beginning of June, or maybe it was in May, it may have been in May. And I am very late in filming this because almost all of her summer products are gone and we are releasing the fall products in less than two weeks. So I am very late in doing this. Shame on me. I will definitely do my best to get the fall one up much sooner because she's got adorable Halloween stuff. I'm so excited right now. They are, and they smell so good. Oh, they smell so good. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and show you... Uh, little clip of what the store looked like when she had the summer stuff all set up. It was so cute and so pretty. She had five different scents. So I bought products and there was nine different types of products in five different scents. So I bought each of the nine different types across those five scents. So you'll get to see all of them. And then of course I will link her website below so that you can go there and see things that you can order and check things out and I'll put her social media. Um, but yeah, definitely do that. So let's look at the little clip of the store. to begin I could not decide what to get in what however there is one scent this year I believe just one maybe two I think she's had raspberry lemonade before too but anyway grape limeade she's had before so I have other grape limeade products that I have left from last year that I've not used all of them up so I only got one grape limeade thing and then let's see here, trying to sort this out. Okay, so the raspberry, let's start with grape limeade. So if you've never had grape limeade before, like the drink grape limeade, then the best way to describe this is grape mixed with like a lime soda. And it is so good. It is delicious. But she had these adorable bottles. Check this out. This is body wash. And for each of the five cents, she had these adorable bottles. There are still a couple left in the store. Um, I don't remember what scent is left, but this was the grape limeade one. But look at that. How cute is that? So that is the body wash. The next scent we're going to talk about is the raspberry lemonade. And it smells like just what it says, raspberry lemonade. I got it in a bath bomb. Look at that cute little label in the fun yellow ribbon tied around there. Um, not only are her products all handmade right there in the store, they are hand packaged in the store as well. So it is a very like hands-on business and it is awesome. And like I've said in other videos, her products are all natural based. So you have things like shea butter and coconut oil and beeswax and that sort of things to make the products. The color, of course, that's added to it, um, it's like she uses some, some of that's not natural, um, like the food coloring. And then the fragrance oil, some of those aren't natural, but everything else that's in it is natural products. So also in the raspberry lemonade is a bar soap. So this is a cold press bar soap and it's been crinkle cut, but look how fun this is. Like seriously, and it's got all those chunky pieces in there for exfoliating and the top of it looks really cool. It's 
just awesome. Like, I love her bar soaps. I am addicted to them. Okay, third scent is Island Coconut. This is a very beachy coconut smell. Um, it was like, I'm not, I don't like coconut food, but I don't mind the scent as much. I usually prefer it if it's got other things in it. Like her best selling scent is coconut mango. She also has coconut lime verbena and I love both of those, but this isn't bad, but it's not my favorite um, out of all of them. However, it seemed to be everybody else's favorite this summer because it sold like hotcakes, but I got a wax melt in it. So I have this Island coconut wax melt and yes, she makes the wax melts as well. Mm. And let me just tell you something, Scentsy people are going to hate me, but these are kind of a lot better than Scentsy. Let me tell you why I think so. First of all, they smell more real. Like Scentsy scents to me, Scentsy's bars smell fake, which isn't necessarily bad, you know, if you don't mind like more perfumey smell, but these smell real, like much more real and they're stronger. See these? Whenever I put in a Scentsy thing, I have to put in two bars and the scent only lasts about a day. I put in this, I only put in one bar, one piece of the bar, I mean, and it will last sometimes two days and it's a lot stronger, like the scent's a lot stronger. So whatever she has done to figure out the formula to make these, she's doing amazing. Also in Island Coconut, I got the body butter. I figured that'd be a good scent, just a coconut scent for a body butter. And it's the whipped body butter. And she did these cute little metal top containers for this summer for those. But look at this. Oh, now we're going to have light problems again. There we go. Look at that. Oh, yummy, yummy, yummy. It's just so delicious and yummy. And then you just scoop out what you need and put it on. And okay, I'll stop now. All right. Next, we have Sparkling Berry Punch. So, how would I describe this? It does have a bit of a punch smell, like a fruit drink smell. Oh, and this one mm, is one of my personal favorites from this summer. So this one I'm smelling is the bath salts. So you just dump these little salts into your bathtub and it will scent your bath water and and then the oils in it and stuff will help give um like soften your skin. In fact it's got dead sea salt and Epsom salt and baking soda and then the fragrance oil and the mica coloring. So I love these containers that she used for this. So fun. She had some like this is all one color but the raspberry lemonade one was like yellow and pink and it was swirled and it looked kind of like those sand bottles that you can make you know like the bottles that you pour different colored sands in it looked pretty awesome so that is the bath salts also in sparkling berry punch i have a body spray and i absolutely love her body sprays they work good as room sprays they work good as um car sprays they even work really good, like if you've been walking all day in Vegas and your feet stink whenever you take your shoes off and you can spray it in your shoes and then they smell all better. So yeah, just so you know, that smells really good too. But this lasts for a very long time. I love her body sprays. Last but not least, the fifth scent for this summer was Pink Berry Tart. So I got it in a lotion bar. And if you've seen any of my other naturally inspired videos, you will know that this lotion bar just twists up. You apply it to your skin just like that. You can put it on your face as a moisturizer. You can even use it as a pomade for your hair if you would like. And oh, oh, this smells so good. I'm not even sure how to describe it. It's sweet. The Pinkberry Tart is sweet. So yeah, Pinkberry Tart's kind of a perfect name for it. Like a berry tart. But the lotion bars are a more solid form of the like body butter. Um, it has beeswax in it instead of the, um, let's see, what is it instead of? I think of instead of the mango butter, so it makes it a little bit harder. And they're great for carrying around in your purse. Last, but certainly not least, I got a polishing salt scrub in the pink berry tart. So again, this adorable container with the tin lid. There you go. And it is the nice whipped body scrub. I can't tip this one upside down. It'll fall out. But there you go. You can see how pretty and pink that is. And this is awesome for using in the shower, for exfoliating, getting rid of all that dead skin. 
makes your skin nice and soft and the oils in it make it nice and soft so yeah so that's some pretty awesome stuff and a really great haul from her store again two weeks and our fall scents will be coming out um i'm sure you've probably figured this but i'll just give you a hint of some of the scents and that would be pumpkin yeah that's kind of obvious for fall but anyway thank you very much for watching i hope that you subscribe and watch more of my videos and hit the little bell so you'll be notified whenever i come up with new ones and i will talk to you soon have a great night bye for now